último, último. Sí. On behalf of All India Plastic Manufacturing Association, I welcome all of you to the launch of Kenya Plast. I am really blessed to inherit a fantastic legacy from stalwarts of plastic industry. IPMA is 67 years strong and only because of contribution by past industry entrepreneurs who have really put in years of service to make IPMA what it is today. Our Plastic Vision India is now among the top Because of Plastic Vision 2011, we got a boost and we could take a bold step to step outside the country. Last division Arabia, I am happy to share with you is a grand success beyond what we had imagined. We had uh, exhibitors from 19 countries, visitors from 66 countries and it was absolutely thrilling to see IPA flag fluttering outside Sharjah Expo Center. So, I am really, really blessed to inherit a great legacy and take it forward. It is, I have done last mile connectivity. It was very little effort and we, we could do so much. It could be achieved in very short time because of the solid foundation that all of you have supported and laid before me. With the same courage and same vision, we are going to Africa. Africa is going to be what India is today, maybe after 15 years, 20 years. We have to begin from now. We have to start investing from now. Because that is where the human power, like human resources, 
the mineral resources are ample. It's just a question of time before that continent will grow. And basically new plastic factories are only coming in Asia, Gulf and Africa. And now we have covered all three regions with our own IPMA shows. That will help Indian plastic industry to boldly venture outside and get business linkages to India. We have taken uh, Mr. Rajapilla, is author of a bestseller book. We have taken it to China with us to study uh, the Chinese strategy and advise us on you know, how we should uh, lead the industry into a uh, growth phase. And uh, what he had pointed out is you should study the strength of China. You should study how what is powering China today? And that is FDI, foreign direct investment. That is powering China. And that FDI is coming from Europe, America, Taiwan, other countries outside China. So China was bold enough to go outside, build bridges, and bring FDI into India. And we are doing the same. We are building bridges with Indian plastic industry. We have signed MOU with plastic associations in USA, in UK, in Italy, in European Union, Turkey, Egypt, Korea, Taiwan. Now all these places we have linkages and these linkages are for us to use to bring their exhibitors to our shows, their information to our magazine, our information about, about our events to in their magazines, information exchange if any of our member want to buy anything from those areas or sell anything in those areas or want to find partners or want to have some part, uh, um, uh, you know, attract FDI into his own business, we have bridges, we have linkages. So, ITMA is very very important. Also, we have with UNIDO done a technology upgradation drive across India. We have done constraint analysis as to how, what are the constraints to growth of industry. And we, have, we understand, all of us understand what are the constraints and we have started acting upon it. So, for the land is the biggest constraint in India today and on the land, uh, we have already uh, dispersed about 100 acre in the hedge to members at the rate of government. So, that is uh, received very well. We are starting a common facility center there to facilitate those industry with best amenities so their viability will become better. In Saran, 240 acre land has been designated as IPA industrial zone. I, I really feel proud to see IPA name on such a huge project. And uh, now we are taking a step. We are talking to Karnataka, to Pradesh, to Andhra Pradesh, to UP, to several states. Our target is to take industry, industry facilitate in industry, doesn't matter where they are. They should get reasonable sized land at reasonable cost near to their home base. We also signed MOU with SIDBI to attract funding, easy funding for our members. We have taken delegations outside country, sizable delegations. Our Sharjah delegation was 175 people. China plus delegation was about 100 people. And because of the linkages that we built, Asokomo plus supported uh, about 18 managing committee members to visit their show PLAST 2012 at entirely Italian government cost. Now all this exposure, all these linkages will only will make it easier for our industry to grow. And I really, really appreciate the support that we are getting from the industry and from all of you. I am sure our new project would get your blessings by way of participation in exhibition, by joining us for a visit for Kenya Safari, basically all of us can put together a bit of work, use our contacts, help us with data in that area, help us with some connection in that area. This is our new, new venture outside for the first time and we have partners, we have local partnership with local associations, we have a lot of data with us based on our Sharjah experience. But every bit that we get from industry will be put to good use to make Indian industry proud outside the country. Most of the exhibitors in Sharjah were very happy. All the people who have displayed machinery have repeated their participation with bigger booths. So when you go to the shows like this, please remember, literacy in those areas are not very high. They are not very uh, reading friendly country. 
So if you are thinking that just by putting a poster you, you can get business, please understand, you got to invest a bit more. Maybe take a machine or maybe put a plasma TV, show your machine in operation. Display your products, don't just put posters. Very few people in those areas are fast readers. They will not, they are not going to read, but if you show them something, they will stop by and give you business. So most of the people who have displayed products, most of the people who have displayed machinery have got fantastic response. And uh, we invite you to join our drive to prosperity together and lead our industry into a better tomorrow. Thank you so much. Thank you, Jayesh Bhai, for your informative address about ECMA activities. Friends, as you all know, Kenya Plus 2012 in association with KMG, any exhibition or event, uh, sponsors pay a major part. And one of our major sponsors is Uniclass International. They have been a great support in Tasti Arabia and now they are pledged their support to Kenya Plus. We have a representative, Mr. Vishal Doshi from Kenya Plus, uh, from Uniplus. I may I request uh, Mr. Rajubai Desai to acknowledge their presence with our cloud today. So we shall go see this. First, Chairman Advisory Board, Class Division, Mr. Abhin Mehta, to kindly address the audience. Thank you, Doctor. Dear President, Vajubai Vagasya from Ahmedabad representing KMG now, Arish Bhai, Kailash Bhai, <coughs> Dr. Manish, everybody, my dear friends. It is a great pleasure for us that now IFMA is changing the curve. Before three, four years, we decided you know, amongst ourselves that we should have a younger generation at the helm of affairs and we promoted consciously, that I would call it. And uh, gradually, maybe some tough road and everything, but we see that we have a cohesive committee with the harmony and doing the work. We promoted all the people and uh, out of the box, we had a bad experience in our past. We were their agents for so many years, but our during Dr. Parma's time, then Yogesh Bhai time, and uh, this one, uh, Jayesh Bhai time, we had uh, the experience that we will not gain much. We, being an agent, I mean, so I decided to go as an organizer. So we found out the partner, Jayesh Bhai took the lead, Yogesh Bhai took the lead, and uh, they went to Dubai and uh, found, found out those people came to our plus television show and uh, we had, and finally, we sealed the things, Sharjah Chamber of Commerce. Friends, you won't believe that their association, of, it is an association, so their office is just like a Rashtrapati Bhavan. I would call it on that line. It is fantastic, something like that. And they came in and we were able to rope in and everything. So they decided that they supported us and we supported them. Ajay took the brunt, that is Sharjah, everybody knows Dubai, nobody knows Sharjah, see, little that you can't do the business and this and that everything. But we took up the challenge, he did the groundwork excellently. In the managing committee we had lot of questions, lot of questions whether we will be successful or not successful. Jayesh Bhai drove the things, breaking the psychological barriers and that, that whole process went on well. You see, ultimately when we went to Sharjah, we were rather skeptical and the exhibitors had low expectation. But fortunately and everything, we had totally 150 exhibitors around, uh, around I think 3,000 exhibitors. Visitor flow was around 7,000 and out of that, friends, mind-boggling thing is that from here is that 66 countries visitors were there. So that is a big, big achievement on our part. And when we, it was comparatively, comparatively easy for us to organize an exhibition outside than in India. <laughs> that is, no problems, nothing, power, no problems, the signage is no problem, table no problem, no problem, nothing was there. So, on the contrary, we were more free uh, uh, than here in India. So, anyway, that is the other side of the story. 
But there is a good solution. We had 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 a good solution. Friend, then we decided in, in between before a year only that we, we should promote the, the plastic industry out of India. Now, as an association, any association cannot take the exhibition outside on its own because association has the limit, limitations. We have the limitation, maybe any, any association, maybe Plastinia, maybe IMI, maybe XYZ, whatever. Why? Because they don't have that base there in that country and you need some, some, some entrepreneur to take the lead. So fortunately for our this African market, KMG, that is Kamlesh Bhai, he is not here today, but he came and he had the idea about it. He is the organizer of Bangla Plus and all that. And he met us. And we have to and go, let us join hands and we go forward. So we have gone to Kenya Plus. Harish Bhai is the chairman and driving very well. We have very good booking also. And uh, we feel that this is the right way of going to the whole, whole our uh, many, many dignitaries were there and there is a good echo. So similarly in Kenya we have good support from the embassy, from the embassy and all that. So friends, I would request you to participate in a big way or visit us, visit there in Kenya and see the difference. New venture and this will be there. So. I would request Harish Bhai to tell everything. This industry, Kenyan plastic industry is mature and I think around 600 converters are there and a lot of adjoining countries are there. It is good market for us. And our representatives, means our brothers, our ancestors or our friends, they are there. So mostly the Indian plastic, uh, this uh, Kenyan plastic industry is in the hands of Indians and especially Gujaratis from the, this one. So this is a good opportunity. They can be our ambassadors also. They can buy our machines or molds or master batches or anything. So win-win situation is there. So thank you and uh, promote the plastic industry. Thank you very much. Friends, we have uh, within us our friend from Gujarat, Mr. Vajubai Vagasia, advisor KMG Group, past president GSTMA. May I now request Vajubai to share a few words. He is also the current president of Lagu Udyog Party. So it's our pleasure to have us in the team. Thank you, Doctor. Thanks, good evening. I think I have to use the national language. I have to use the English language. Being a Gujarati, I have to use the English but English language is also must for interaction of international business and international talk and interaction. But Bharatiya Bhasa ko bhul jaye ho achha nahi. President Jayesh Bhai Rambia, Arvind Bhai, Arun Si, Manish Bhai, Doctor Raju Bhai, Hari Bhai, Kiri Bhai. Itna bada logon naam jaanu chuka hai. Ab badara naam bola jis to time bola jata rese. Raju Bhai Tolaat also. Rogesh Bhai also, yes, yes. Harpal Singh. Harpal Singh. Both, 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 both. So many people whom I know personally since many, many years. But today I got the opportunity. I am not an advisor of KMG. I am an advisor of EPMA. You accept it. And I have given you the advice of KMG. And I am working on the work. I am also going to do the advice of KMG. I am going to do the work there. Sorry to interrupt. I am going to do the work there. इन्होंने एडवाइजर बोला था इसकी एक बड़ी सबसे बड़ी अचीवमेंट किया मैं आपसे आप बता दूं लास्ट इंडिया में मेरे टेन्यूर में जो हम लोगों ने 50 एकड़ जमीन जो पंजाबी में जो वाइब्रेंट गुजरात में वो साइन करके तो 99 परसेंट हिस्सा इनका है सो ही इज आवर ट्रू एडवाइजर गवर्नमेंट की पॉलिसी का मैंने सिर्फ प्रचार प्रसार किया है दूसरा कुछ नहीं किया है मगर Being a very good relation with the government, मेरी government से relation इतनी अच्छी है कि मैं साथ में जाता हूँ, तो थोड़ा और फायदा होता है, थोड़ा और अपनी इंटरव्यूसी बढ़ती है। दूसरा कुछ मैंने कोई वो बड़ा काम नहीं किया है, मगर इंडस्ट्री के लिए काम करना, I am from RSS, RSS का मैं स्वयं शेवक हूँ, हमको एक चीज सिखाई है, कि जो आदमी � कोई काम ही नहीं रहेगा इनके पास और कोई गुंडा माफिया क्राइम पैदा ही नहीं हो इस बीस को पचास को सौ को मेंटेन करता है 
उसका काम परोपकार दूसरे का काम तो हम वो काम करते तो मैं वो काम करता हूँ ठीक है आज हम कन्या प्लास्ट के लॉन्चिंग में वाई कन्या प्लास्ट अरे वाई विथ प्रोफेशनल एजेंसी एक बहुत बड़ा सवाल सबके मन में होता है कि अपन तो अकेले एक्टिवेशन करते हैं इतना बड़ा प्लास्टिक करते हैं इतना बड़ा प्लेक्सपो करते हैं इतना बड़ा प्लास्ट इंडिया भी करते हैं तो वाई विथ प्रोफेशनल एजेंसी आप देखो कि विदाउट प्रोफेशनलिज्म देर इज नो डेवलपमेंट विदाउट डेलीगेशन देर इज नो डेवलपमेंट अपनी डेवलपमेंट की एक लिमिट होती है एक सीमा होती है एक बॉर्डर होती है तो बॉर्डर के बाद अपने को प्रोफेशनलिज्म में जाना पड़ता है आपने सुना होगा कहीं प्रॉब्लम्स आए थे प्लास्ट इंडिया में बहुत चर्चा है डिस्कशन हुआ था ये हमारी गलती नहीं है अगर प्रोफेशनल एजेंसी फॉर सर्विस के लिए होती तो ये प्रॉब्लम नहीं होता तो ये पूरा सर्विस उद्योग है इस खाली पैसा कमाने का उद्योग नहीं है अगर आप पार्टिसिपेंट को सर्विस नहीं देंगे पार्टिसिपेंट को विजिटर अच्छे नहीं देंगे पार्टिसिपेंट्स को अच्छी इम्यूनिटीज नहीं देंगे तो ये एक्टिवेशन का कोई मतलब नहीं है पैसा तो बनता है पैसा तो मिलता ही है आपने स्टोर बुक कर लिया पैसा आ गया फिर क्या तो उसके बाद की जो चीज है वो सर्विस है वो सर्विस के लिए प्रोफेशनल मैनेजमेंट इज रिक्वायर्ड आप सब जानते हैं आप तो बम्बे वाले हैं मैं तो अहमदाबाद आऊंगा तो प्रोफेशनल रिजम में जाना पड़ेगा अगली बार आप शायद शायद ऐसा होगा प्लेसपो शायद ऐसा होगा और सभी जगह शायद ऐसा होगा ये दो चार पांच छह सात सो हम कर ले ठीक है उसकी एक साइज थी दस बीस मीटर की मुझे पचास हजार में लाख में या दो लाख में जाना है तो प्रोफेशनलिज्म इज मस्ट ये अपने को स्वीकार करना पड़ेगा इसमें हम जाएंगे तो रियली वी विल गिव वेरी गुड सर्विस टू अवर पार्टिसिपेंट वेरी गुड बिजनेस टू अवर पार्टिसिपेंट वेरी गुड जॉइंट वेंचर्स टू अवर पार्टिसिपेंट तो ये अपने को सोचना पड़ेगा सर्विस इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इन इन एनी ऑफ द सर्विस इंडस्ट्री दिस इज द सर्विस इंडस्ट्री कम मार्केटिंग कम तो अपने को ये सोचना चाहिए इसीलिए एक एम जो कंपनी है मैं भी क्यों एडवाइजर उसका बना मेरे लिए भी एक सवाल था इंजीनियरिंग के बड़े बड़े एग्जीबिशन वो कंपनी कर रही थी मैंने उसको कहा कि आपको इंजीनियरिंग के साथ साथ प्लास्टिक डिविजन भी शुरू करना चाहिए क्यों कि अभी बहुत स्कोप है प्लास्टिक के डेवलपमेंट का बहुत स्कोप है तो उन्होंने मेरी बात स्वीकार किया प्लास्टिक डिविजन ओपन किया मैं उसका एडवाइजर हूँ मगर फर्क ये हुआ हिंदुस्तान में जितने एसोसिएशन चलते हैं उससे उनका रिलेशन कैसे बने और वो कैसे अच्छी बढ़िया